Mm, okay, how do I describe her? She's a stripper? But she's so much more than that. Her name is Cardi B. She is this Dominican and Trinidadian woman from the Bronx. And she just says the realest, most greatest things on Instagram. Like, just because you see me on the street and I'm wearing like busted up sneakers and I'm wearing a regular old bag and pay less shoes, don't think that I'm like, a bum because I'm not I'm saving my money I'm not trying to dance forever and I'm like oh that's real what makes a a PhD candidate any better than a sex worker mm -hmm. they're going about living out their life in very different ways and I don't think that it's fair to judge and say oh well because you all of your clothes is on it means that you're you have more purpose in life I don't think that finding purpose is something that people can drive you to I think that a lot of the times we don't know and we're just like, what is this all about? Sometimes you wake up and you're just like, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. I don't want to go outside. I don't want to do my homework. I don't want to go to work. I don't know why I'm doing this. When I wake up and I'm sh and I'm feeling those days where I'm like, I don't know what, what, what am I doing? Why am I going to work? For what reason? I start to like take detail in what I'm doing. So if I'm getting on the bus, I'd be like, oh, let me look and see what I can pick out out of just like anything random that's happening that will make me smile. So I have this uh, professor, her name is Dr. Yearwood, and she changed my life. I have anxiety as far as like not being smart enough or not being like good enough in like academic spaces. So I took a midterm and I failed the midterm like bad. And she was like, it's fine. And she was like, come see me after class. And I was like, no, because I don't want to be that kid. She would always, she would actually push me and be like, you, I don't like the way you wrote this, so write it again. But she was doing it for a reason. And at the end of the class, I was like, you changed my life. Like, I'm a better writer because of you. I pay attention more because of you. I'm, I guess, less sensitive in academic spaces because of you. She's one of the reasons why I'm like, oh, like, maybe I can go to grad school. Like, maybe I'm, maybe I'm not as dumb as I believe that I am sometimes. I was kind of made for this. So I think that your purpose is that, what you're made for, but nobody can tell you what you're made for but yourself.